all around the globe, from thick jungles to murky rivers, and even deep in the ocean, some creatures have developed mind-blowing weapons to help them stay alive and thrive. Join us as we explore five remarkable creatures and their unique arsenals. First we have the Lonomia Caterpillar, also known as the Assassin Caterpillar. A species of Saturnid moth from South America, despite its innocent, fuzzy appearance, they're actually one of the most venomous caterpillars on the planet. Those tiny spines on its body are not just for decoration, they're like its own built-in barbed wire security system. Each spine is packed with a potent toxin. Imagine brushing up against one of these by accident. The result? Intense pain, swelling, and in severe cases, internal bleeding. This caterpillar's venom interferes with your blood's ability to clot, leading to a dangerous condition called disseminated intravascular coagulation. This can cause uncontrollable bleeding and even organ failure. The Lonomia caterpillar with its venomous spines turning its entire body into a formidable defense system, making any predator think twice before attempting a taste and risking a painful, potentially deadly encounter. Next we have the Bombardier beetle. It might look like just another ordinary bug, but it's got some extraordinary superpowers. There are hundreds of species of bombardier beetles living around the world, found on every continent except Antarctica. Each species has its own unique adaptations, but some share one incredible feature. See that little nozzle on its backside? That's where the magic happens. Here's how it works. The beetle has two chambers in its abdomen, each containing different chemicals, hydrogen peroxide and hydroquinones. When it senses danger, it contracts muscles to mix these chemicals in a third chamber where they react with catalytic enzymes. This reaction creates a burst of boiling hot, toxic chemicals that are then expelled explosively from the beetle's rear end. This defense mechanism is no joke, reaching temperatures hotter than your morning coffee and leaving predators feeling like they've just had firecrackers go off in their mouths, similar to a tiny explosion. The Bombardier Beetle proves that size doesn't matter when it comes to survival. Sometimes all you need is a little chemical firepower to keep predators at bay. And now we have the Archer Fish, nature's underwater sharpshooter with some seriously cool hunting skills. Found in rivers and mangroves of Asia and Australia, the archerfish has mastered the art of shooting water like a magical wizard. It can shoot down bugs from several feet away, adjusting for light refraction like a true sniper with incredible precision. Imagine you're a bug minding your own buggy business on a leaf above the water, then splash! Out of nowhere, a jet of water knocks you into the watery depths below, leading to your demise. This super skill is the archerfish's secret weapon. It helps it snag its dinner from a safe distance, outsmarting the sneaky predators lurking in the crowded waters. Interestingly, young archerfish aren't born as expert marksmen. Just like us, they need some practice to perfect their aim. They start off with a few misses and gradually get better over time. Studies have shown that these little guys learn to nail their shots through good old-fashioned trial and error. The archerfish dedicate their whole lives to perfecting their marksmanship, constantly refining their techniques to become the sharpshooters of the river. Next up is the electric eel, the Thor of the aquatic realm. This creature is a living, breathing, swimming battery. Hailing from the rivers, lakes, and streams of tropical South America, the electric eel is a force to be reckoned with. Despite its name and serpentine appearance, the electric eel is not actually an eel. It's more closely related to carp and catfish. This creature can generate a whopping 600 volts of electricity from specialized organs called electrocytes. That's like having your own power station right inside your body. With this incredible ability, the electric eel can stun prey and keep predators at bay. The electric eel can also use its electric superpower to navigate, locate prey, and communicate. It emits a low-level charge, less than 10 volts, which it uses like radar. When it finds its prey, it unleashes a much stronger shock to stun it. The electric eel's electric shock is a weapon that's both a shield and a sword, allowing it to stun and deter predators. This remarkable creature is living proof that nature is full of surprises, just waiting to shock you, literally. At last, we have the pistol shrimp. Now, being called a shrimp doesn't exactly make you known for having sizable strength or an intimidating presence, but they have a secret weapon that crushes the stereotype in a dramatic way. They make a splash in the underwater world by creating something that seems as harmless and playful as bubbles. 
but don't be fooled, these bubbles are far from ordinary. They pack a punch with a sound that's louder than a gunshot. The monstrous sound isn't actually caused by the parts of the claw impacting each other. As the shrimp open their large snapper claw, water fills the small crook. Upon closing the claw with impressive force, a plunger-like piece shoots the water out at speeds as fast as a car traveling down the highway and can generate heat that reaches 8,000 degrees Fahrenheit, four times hotter than lava. It's kind of like Iron Man's repulsor beams, but underwater. But there's more to this shrimp than just its snap. It's also a team player. It shares a burrow with a goby fish. The goby keeps an eye out for danger while the shrimp digs their home. It's like they're their own little Avengers team. So there you have it, the pistol shrimp. Small in size, but big on surprises. Remember, it's not the size of the shrimp in the fight, it's the size of the fight in the shrimp. Thanks for joining us on this adventure. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to splash that like button, subscribe, and comment below which superpower was most interesting to you. I'll catch you in the next one.